Fans welcome to Kokos TV number 1 African Online TV ambapo leo niko hapa kwa Hangtu na msanii mmoja ambaye anatoka sehemu hizi za Helloret na leo tunaenda kuongelea mambo tu na usanii na vile vile mambo kuhusu challenges za usanii na vile amepita katika usanii wake so make sure unani follow up pale Kokos TV subscribe make sure unani follow kwa Facebook Not newspaper, make sure you follow IG, Cocos Creator, make sure you follow pale kwa Twitter, pia ni Cocos Creator, adama TikTok, ni Cocos Creator. Make sure you follow kwa kila mahali, hili uwezi kupata abit zote, sawazani kutoka ini hila Helloret. So make sure you follow na make sure unafanya file tunafanyanga. So leo ni kuna msani moja ambayo yuko hapa, angetuambia ya anaitu anani, ametokea wapi, amelelea wapi, na vile vile, halijingiza aje kwenye usani. So karibu sana. Sante sana. Thank you. Labda utuambie majina kamili na umetokea wapi na umeanze aje usani. <laughs> Kwa majina naituwa Peter Williams. Uh, jina la kisani ni Liam. Liam Lee. Hata uki nitafuta kwa social media zote utanipata Liam Lee. Uh, nimekuwa tu nikiimba ever since, since I was a kid. I've been singing. Nili kwa introduced to present worship. And that's how imekuwa, imekuwa badi up to now. How many years sasa tanguanse kuimba? <laughs> ama 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 miaka ngapi tanguanse kuimba ile provision ile oh, serious? Professionally. Yeah. All right, nilianza ku record uh, 2014. 2014 wakati tu nilijoin campus nikaenda nikatafuta producer fulani nika mu inbox akan direct and that's when I recorded my first song. Then from there I've been doing songs. Yes. Najua uko kwa maybe kwa band tafauti tafauti na maybe kuna singine labda na iso, but bado uko kwa band ama bado uko kwa band? Yes, niko kwa band, niko kwa worship team. So band na work with Worship Beyond Music, WBM, na worship team ya kanisa KEG, where I church. Okay, kando na kando pale na band uko na ngoma zako, mwezo umesi produce we mwenye ngoma zako personal? Yes, yes, yeah. I have like... Nimefanya about three singles of niko na a whole album that I did with someone. Nilikuwa nika collab. Yeah. One of your biggest song ambayo unasemanga, I did this song. Na ime nifanya, nimefikia ki wangu fulani wimbo gani? <laughs> well, I've, I've done so many. Uh, different songs inspired differently. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Niko na... Nikona Haulali and I have I have a song I did with someone in Aitwa Nayaweza which also speaks to me in in many ways. So the two I think the two are my favorite. So labda kuna mtu ajai ske yo wimbo nayaweza. Unaisa imba kakora skidogo ndi ajue nawesa hata wanapo kisachi pale nayaweza juu hata mina ijua kiasi niliwai ske lakini sasa labda kuna mtu angetaka kuske hizo lyrics ama inaenda ajia. Nayaweza mambo yote Nayaweza mambo yote Katika ye anitia nguvu Mana buwana ni nguvu zangu Najua ye ya taniwezesha Mana buwana nguvu zangu Najua ye ya taniwezesha Wow, wow, nice song, wow. So, katika usani, kuna afijano wengi ambalo labda wanataka kuingia katika usani na tunajua usani Kenya ikona challenges mingi sana. Na tukijua kwa mba kuna usani labda wameona cosplay maybe ailipi ama cosplay la ina ile 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 hit ama ni ku hit kwa cosplay lingumu sana kwa wale wasani wachanga ambao wanajitokeza wanaweza kuingia katika usani ni nini unge wa advice nini ya muhimu wa ifuatilia kabla wajiingia katika usani yote ile mm -hmm. <laughs> I, i think uh, purpose ni kitu ya maana sana if you follow your purpose you know unajua why you're doing something not alone singing vitu nyingi tu why you're doing something and your purpose ndio itaku keep going despite the many challenges that may come Uh, so as an artist, as a musician, follow your purpose, keep following it too, until one is you can a vision, until one is a So, this is the thing that happen in between you now and 
kwa wakati hiyo vision itakuwa accomplished you will just ignore them because you are following on a certain a certain thing hiyo purpose yako ifuate i think that's what i would tell you also uh, work on your skills follow kutafuta skills Meanwhile, as you wait for your purpose to be accomplished, work on yourself, work on your skills, uh, work on everything that needs to be worked uh, out, and you'll be okay. Yeah. Okay, kuna dhana kwamba labda eh, usani wa Cosbell, wa sani wengu wamejitokeza kwenye wameondokea Cosbell, kama kuna wasani ambayo tunawajua, mm. sitaesa kwa taja haba, lakini kuna wasani ambayo tunawajua wameondokea Cosbell, ujui, wanasemba Cosbell may, maybe ilipi, ama Cosbell iko na challenge, sata last time kulikuwa na, one of the comedian akasema kwamba, eh, 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 many of wasani wameenda pale kwa zegila juu, labda usani ya Cosbell aina ile aina ile halipi ama watu wa Cosbell labda hawezi waji waji support hao wenye unaonaje those one <laughs> yeah i, I think ka, ka mtu ameamua kuimba gospel aimbe gospel mtu wa represent Kenya me ameamua kufuata if if you are representing the industry we represent that industry utapata mtu maybe anaimba gospel because because anatafuta pesa eventually kani pesa anatafuta akuje kwa gospel akose ataenda huko hivyo pia huko akikosa atafanya to something else so you just represent what you representing follow kenya una follow it fall back into purpose so are you singing uh, unaimba, unaimba ku entertain unaimba ku minister unaimba ku represent the kingdom of god ama ku preach why are you singing are you singing to express love kae ameona impe ku express love as he said at gospel gospel is not doing well ama anything it's not about the gospel ni ye mwenyewe na kenya anafuata ye mwenyewe it's not about the gospel ama industry or anything ni yeye tu ni decision ya mtu after all Okay, kila mali kuna challenges, kila ukifika, kila, kila sector kuna challenges zake. Yeah. Uimbaji wa Cosvel, kwe mwenye umekaa pale miaka, nimeona ni miaka 2014, mbaga saini around miaka sita. Yeah. Nini asa challenges kubwa ambao unayasambia vijana ambao unajitokeza kwa manataka kuingia katika usani wa Cosvel. Nini kubwa ambao ni challenges ambao unayasambia, it is the challenges utaface na even di utaifanyeka. Challenges kubwa katika Cosvel ni ipi? <laughs> We... Si. Ah, okay, ama kwa usani kwa ujumla. <laughs> kwa usani. Uh, okay, nikiongelea mambo usani the biggest challenge itakuwa ni maybe you need to unaangalia kuna game imekuwa the game has been changed. Wasee wanafanya kazi safi sana. Wasani wana wako, wanatoa kazi safi ina inachukua inahitaji do, inahitaji passion, inahitaji kujitolea a lot of commitment. Now unapata kama hauna the funding the source of funds inakuwa ni the biggest challenge but hiyo imanishi you should give up you should keep following uh that means jafika i know i'll get there but sasa you you have to keep going kwa sababu if you keep quiet now hapo hivyo ndo utakuwa unajikosea just keep doing whatever you're doing and then noise will be made about you people will see that there is something you're doing and they will continue supporting you and one day god will make a way for you bora tu you keep the hope alive i think that's the only thing to do uh, about the challenge ni mambo tunado kujituma we jitume tu i think that's the main thing Okay, umesema kuna kuna band mko nao na pia ume produce manyimbo. Mm-hmm. Okay, kwa hiyo band labda huwa mnaendanga masherehe ama huwa mnaendanga ma functions mm-hmm. ama mungependa kualiko kwa ma functions. Yeah, our team wa, we we perform different places. Penye tu tumeitwa just we honor invitations. That's what I can say. We honor invitations. Kwa Twitter we go majorly tumekuwa tuki tukikuwa invited for worship leading kwa churches events uh, concerts graduation and events too <laughs> but uh, because jinetu inaitwa worship beyond music ukitwitter ku lead worship that's that's what we can do mostly because we deal mostly na worship leading that's our area Okay, unajua kualikwa kwa makanisa huwa tuna tunaambiwa 
okay sasa hiyo mchungaji anasema mubarikiwe sana na labda ajawatoa kwa ile design mzuri labda umekuja na fair labda umekuja na nini huwa mnahitaji chache siote mnapoitwa ndio ule mwenye ana watch labda angetaka mkuje kanisa yake mfanye worship ama muid worship ama wako na function di vizuri ajue kwamba huyo mtu akikuja lazima afanyiwe hivi ndio akuwe ready asiwaambie mubarikiwe Wait, wait, wait. That's a whole topic. That's a, <laughs> a whole topic. I think we should we should come into a knowledge uh, about how maybe to deal with artists and ministers now that we are in the gospel context. How to deal with ministers, but uh, I think we need to figure out to to tell one, to tell one because now, for example, we we are young people everyone ana lead life yake ako na cha kufanya alafu tumeitwa maybe a place like let's say Mombasa and you need to use fair you need to to lodge there you need to eat you need to do all those things so in akoga sometimes ni una, unaangalia logistics more than the money uh, we we look into the logistics more than the money mhm kuna maybe wenye upenda maybe ku bless the ministry now I think that is your personal decision but as much as logistics is mekwa met it's possible we see we end and as it's not always about money it's not always about money if it's possible to fika uko ivata without using the money <laughs> it's, it's always possible Okay okay na dhara wamekusikia vizuri kwenye yeah. wanaendelea kuoje Coco TV so kuna jambo lingine ningependa labda tuongelee kuhusu jambo la kuhusu mambo okay kuhusu 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 sanii individually kuna kuna kwamba labda wasanii waje waje kuwa ile serious ku ku express the gospel in the, ama kufanya the gospel industry ikwe juu ama kufanya the gospel industry kwa live pas ka, kwe kama personally si sasa si okay sio wasanii wote wewe kama personally unaonaje ile situation kwamba wasanii kwamba wameanza wame kutoa manyimbo zile ambazo labda eh waongozi na roho mtakatifu ama waongozi na na desturi za za kikanisa so wewe unaona haje kama hawa sanii ambao wame, wameondoka kando na kanisa kidogo kutoa manyimbo ambazo labda ukiziona asiambatani na na vile dini inaita, ama kanisa inahitajika <laughs> i think let, let me answer that question kutumia njia nyingine aha there are people when you are men ahead of us there are people blessed ministers of the gospel of Christ Jesus through music and when you are coming up i think wakati sisi tunaanza tuna grow we should always link up with someone to look for mentorship the bible says that my people are getting lost because of lack of knowledge and understanding if you do not have an understanding of of what you're doing that's when you get lost uh it's not to mean that you cannot or you cannot do it it's not to mean that it's far from or from your reach ama from your ability what is what is there that is to be done ni ufuate ufuate muongozo maybe you be fathered ama mentored you be taught you sit under the teaching you be patient you learn and you grow pia si lazima hata mtu but it's always important to have someone always again uko naomba uko unasikiza roho mtakatifu so that he can guide you as a christian or as a minister because uh, the bible says in in acts 1:8 that we received power when the spirit of the lord came upon us so it's him who enables us and it's him who teaches us if you do not have the spirit of god or if you're not led in the spirit of god that's when you get lost but if you have him he will diligently lead you and you will have wisdom from god so autafanya kitu then people are, are like no and then if it's approved of the spirit of god everyone will always tell watasema hii imekuwa led by the spirit of god okay sure okay so, tunapoenda kumalizia ningependa maybe uambie kwenye watatasama video hii you are penye unaweza patikana kama ni kama ni facebook kama unapatikana kama kuna namba sababu mtu anaweza kupata kitaji labda manyimbo zako aje vile anaweza ipata ama kama uko nasikiza pia unaweza waambia na kama hiyo 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 bana ambayo mko nayo labda unaweza ndio anaweza wapataje well uh, niko facebook niko twitter niko instagram tiktok youtube i think across all 
ukienda uni search Liam Lee L Y A M L E L Y A M L E utanipata um ukienda u inbox if you want the band pia uki inbox kwa page ya band worship beyond music wbm utatupata hapo hivyo but even if you inbox me kwa my social handles i will respond and we will have a conversation there kuna mtu hapo anaangalia hii video anataka angetaka kuwa msanii your last advice to those people ambao wanataka kuingia katika usanii ama your last tot kuhusu au watu ambao wanataka kuingia sasa kuna kijana hapa anai watch kuna mtu ambaye anaiangalia angependa kuingia katika usani you are last last remarks kwa huyo mtu ningeambiaje mm. i'll tell you two things uh, everything is possible everything is possible with god i love for the last thing i can tell you is um, when you have something in you wewe mwenyewe unajua what it is that it that you have now if you believe in yourself that is when we will believe in you so believe in yourself uh, wake up and just start doing it and the layer two don't stop do it as much as you can we will believe in you because you believe in yourself yes thank you very much so make sure na follow up kwenye my youtube kokos tv subscribe make sure na nifuata pale kwa twitter ig the same name pale kwa 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 Facebook make sure unani follow not newspaper make sure una click pale unai unai like na pia unai post na u make sure una share pia pale vile vile fuata Liam Lee pale kwa Facebook make sure unai like make sure unai follow then kila kitu itakuwa sawa thank you for watching have a nice day